Cappuccino tool. Go to Character Menu, Open Manager, and choose Cappuccino Tool. Use Start Real-Time button for multiple keyframe recording. It tells Cappuccino to start recording as soon as the mouse button is pressed within the viewport and stop when it is released again. With Cappuccino you can quickly create all kinds of realistic movements for your 3D characters and models simply by recording mouse movements. Since Cappuccino creates very many keyframes, a large number of superfluous keyframes are generated. Hence, it is advisable to apply the key reducer. Open layout menu and choose animation. As you can see, we have created a lot of unnecessary keyframes for scale and rotation. Next time do not forget to turn off the parameters for which you do not need the keyframes. We haven't animated scale, rotation and Y position, so we can select them and delete. Click on F curve mode. Let's create a snapshot for this keyframes. Open F curves menu. Go to make snapshot and click on create snapshot 1. And view the snapshot. Select the tracks or F curves whose key should be reduced. Open Function menu and choose Key Reducer. As soon as one of the sliders is released, the reduction value will return to 0%. If you are still not satisfied with the result you can either define another value or undo the reduction. You can make changes for the curves. Use the Control button if you want to add a new frame or delete button to remove unnecessary frames. Head looks nice. Now do the same with Z position. Like and subscribe if you learned something new. And thanks for watching.